999,999,991 Oh hey, you guys just happened to catch me in my morning million bicep repetition ritual. This is Dylan Lloyd, and I'm gonna give you a rundown with my buck frame. What's up everybody? This is Dylan Lloyd and I'm here at the Manifesto House in California for the next week and I'm gonna give you a rundown on my 2018 buck frame. So, uh, fuck it, let's go. Right, that's good, now I'm running that. So this is my signature buck frame and first off, the first thing I asked we the people was to make it as strong as possible just because I don't want to break my face on doing something big and like a head tube or some tube breaking, so yeah. It's really strong, can't break it, deal proved, never broke one. No one has ever broke one either, so yeah, give it a go. Let's see you try and smash it in. So another thing I wanted with my frame was a bottom bracket height to be a bit higher so you could lock in the crooks easier, and then uh, the standover a bit higher as well because uh, I'm a bit taller, and then you don't have to put your seat as high so you can pinch the, those bar spins good. Another thing too is the head tube is taller so you don't have to stack all those uh, ugly head caps or whatever, spacers and stuff, junk. So yeah, it gives a nice clean look. Flush with the stem, looks solid. So we got investment cast dropouts where they're nice and thick but also small so a pay could fit nice and flush around it and you won't get hung up while you're grinding. Also the chain stay is oval so it'll make it harder to twist and dent, so it gives you a stiffer and more solid bike. <laughs> it also has removable brake hardware, so if you ride trails or park, or if even if you're a brake rider that rides street, you could just slap on those brakes or take them off. Just do whatever you want. So for 2018, uh, we did a couple little changes with the frame. We made the chainstay a tad shorter at 13.2, also, the standover height a bit higher at 9.25. And then we got two new colors. We got ED black and also this super nice Quicksilver, which looks awesome in the sun and as well in the shade. So my signature We The People buck frame as well as bars will be coming out in November. The frame will be coming in 20.5, 20.75, 21 in ED Black as well as Quicksilver. So keep your eyes open for that as well as the future projects I am filming with We The People. So yeah, I'm really stoked with what's going on, what's been filming. So yeah, keep your eyes open and get buck. Wait, what is it called again? All right, so first off, fuck. All right, so with my frame as well, Oh fuck, that sounded weird. Back end isn't super short, but it is like, it's, it's trendy. One second, I'm just gonna go in the shade for one second. I'm super hot.